History Colorado is holding a new speaker series focused on women. It's called Bold Women Change History. Joining me now to tell us about it is Jillian Allison, director of Center of Colorado's Women's History. So let's start with who will be taking part in the speaker series. So throughout the year, we're going to have a variety of speakers. Kicking us off in September on the 15th, we'll have Linda Alvarado, business leader and former owner of the Colorado Rockies. On International Day of the Girl, which is October 11th, we'll be speaking with Jatanjali Rao, a Colorado scientist and inventor who was Time Magazine's first kid of the year. In November on the 10th, we'll be joined by Dr. Carlotta Lanier of the Little Rock Nine, who became an icon of the civil rights movement and has been a Colorado resident for decades. In January, we are thrilled to host Joy Harjo, who is an author and a performer and the first Native American to serve as the US Poet Laureate. And in Women's History Month in March on the 23rd, Pat Schroeder, a feminist icon who was the first female US representative elected in Colorado will join us. And we'll round out the series in May on May 18th with Dr. Bonnie Clark, who's an archeobiographer, scholar, professor, and author um, who's changing the way we think about women in the West. That's awesome. You have some powerful women who will be speaking. Tell us what inspired you to put this speaker series together. So Bold Women Change History uh, began as a part of the Women's Vote Centennial in 2020, which commemorated the marking of the 100th anniversary of the 19th Amendment. So this will be the second installment in the series. And it asks the question, what happens when women have a seat at the table and when they lead? Um, and it's an exciting opportunity to hear directly from the women who are making history, um, to learn from their experiences. Um, and so it's just an opportunity to learn directly from the people who are shaping our world. And it's neat too, because all the women you listed have just such different experiences and different backgrounds. Um, what do you hope that people get out of Bold Women Change History? So we are um, really looking for opportunities for people to connect directly with history, to hear from people's personal experiences and see how we can learn from our past, um, reflect on the moment that we're in and see how we can help shape our future interested in this so how can they take part or what do they need to know so the lectures will be happening at the history colorado center so if you're in denver or uh, are able to make it there we hope that you'll join us in person but you can participate no matter where you are because many of the programs will also be available online uh, we have more information about all of these programs tickets and um, more at historycolorado.org Great, that's neat to have that virtual option as well. Um, Jillian, <laughs> thanks so much for joining us today. We really appreciate it and look forward to hearing more about how the series goes. Thank you. Of course, and we have a link to get tickets and information about Bold Women Change History on our website, cbsdenver.com.